right, folks. Got my Didi tarp here set up in a tent-like fashion. This is a 10 by 10. Excuse the uh, moccasins, slippers there. And the student pack is acting as a nice um, prop up here. So I don't need any internal, you know, uh, frames, internal poles or anything. Got my um, blanket, down blanket. It's a down blanket sleeping bag. I'm lighting equipment. I'm testing it out right now. Um, pretty cool. Pretty awesome. And uh, I got a lot of space in here, actually. Got quite a bit of space in here. Especially with this. I like this tarp setup because I got tons of foot room down there. You can see. Tons of foot room. And I got a lot of space. Headroom here. The steward pack really helps holding this up. Let me just find get a view like that. Let's see the whole thing. And you got a ton of space up there. It's really high up there. I don't know if you can see. It's way high. Very high compared. I can't really reach because I'm propping myself up now, talking to the camera. <laughs> um, but this is how it looks inside. Okay. Nice and toasty warm. And I got it set up in um, a fully enclosed tent system um, with a DD tarp, 10 by 10 tarp, very versatile. And I'm already feeling super hot and warm in here. So I'm just testing it out. Um, and I'll take you on a walk with them right now. Alrighty, folks, here you go. So I'm up here, right about at uh, mid length here. I'm about maybe a little lower than chest level here. And uh, got it right here at this midpoint. And it comes down, it closes down here, and it ties out out there. So you should have a door here. You also have a door on this side here that can close up. And this whole thing can be closed up tight. And this can be locked up on this tent stick here to make a fully enclosed shelter, as you can see. Okay. And just like that. Fully enclosed. All right. And then this 10 by 10 tarp, so it goes on the back. And if the excess just folds underneath. And that's the sleeping bag there. The steward pack is propping it up over here, and as you can see, very, very solid, very solid. I normally carry just four stakes in my pack, um, but uh, I just popped in some, you know, temporary stakes, and that's pretty good. It's a pretty good setup. That's how it is right there. This makes a whole huge difference with a lot of space in the middle without me getting any poles or I don't have any tie outs areas here for these tie outs here, no trees above. So that's a good solution. The student pack, another good use for the student pack because it props itself up just like that. It becomes a nice prop up here, creating a lot more space inside and a lot more headroom. And there's the setup. There you go, just testing it out.